Well, in this wonderful world of cyberspace, you never know what you might stumble upon. Browsing the Internet the other day, I found a story about Chiefs quarterback Brody Croyle. The headline certainly captured my attention. It goes like this. Former Alabama standout Brody Croyle not content as the Kansas City Chiefs back up to Matt Castle. This story appeared in newspapers in a website in Birmingham, Alabama, where Croyle has become part owner of a new fitness center. Now, keep in mind, people in Alabama are football crazy. There's not much to do down there. Croyle has been gone for about five years, but is still highly regarded in his home state. In the story, Croyle talked about why he truly believes he will become the chief starting quarterback. I could not believe what I was reading, folks. This is the same Brody Croyle who has been injured throughout his four-year career in Kansas City. This is the same Brody Croyle who has thrown as many interceptions as touchdowns as a Chiefs quarterback. That number is eight, by the way. I bring this to your attention, not because I think Croyle is trying to start a quarterback controversy before camp opens later this month. That's not his style. Croyle was asked to comment on the Chiefs quarterback situation and wanted all the Alabama fans to know he still has what it takes to play the game. I have no problem with that, although he did embellish his skills as a quarterback, and that's fine. The guy who writes the headlines jumped all over this one, making it sound like Croyle plans to steal away Matt Castle's job. Croyle probably said too much in that interview, not realizing his comments would make its way back to KC. I tell you what, in this day and age, you must be extremely guarded in what you say or you'll pay. Just ask Dwayne Bow. What goes around comes around. The more I think about this, as far-fetched as it seems, do you think maybe Croyle let the cat out of the bag here? Do you think Charlie Weiss has given Croyle a reason to believe he can actually beat out Matt Castle? The Chiefs just signed Croyle to a new deal. I know Castle has that big contract, but Croyle also has that big arm. Let's wait and see. This should be interesting. That's Jack Smack.